Another Assassin's Creed video, this time off the last part of the looking to complete quite a few of the actual main storyline missions. Maybe, but it was worth it. So as I was saying, we are looking at obviously trying to finish off the Sophia Sator part of the actual main storyline. So, uh, a bit old to carry on like as you saw no? yesterday, we must find and kill this assassin we... menace. There is no law but gods for cold killers such as the assassins. Shush. <laughs> So, where was I? Yes. So, completing the missions. As you guys, as I was saying, will already know, the Sophia Sato missions are already tied in with the actual main storyline itself. Obviously, the further through the game you get, the more you unlock, the more you unlock, the further through the Sophia Sato missions you get. So... As you can see, I am making my way very <coughs> quickly, what an eccentric or as man. quickly as possible. <coughs> to the next point on the map, where hopefully me up the side of this building. Come on, Ezio. Here we go. Echo is being a little bit awkward today, but as you can see, as we do make our way up, we also have the additional missions that our recruits were sent on. And here we go. Signs and Symbols, Part 3. Nicola Paola hid a book near Little Hagia, Sophia, containing clues to the Masia Keys location. Use the Paola symbols to reveal. Now, if you remember, Shown you many many times how to do this and it's actually gonna be somewhere pretty flat just like that one but obviously they are going to put a few that are not going to be the right one now as you saw the first one we went to isn't on little Hagia Sophia so that's actually that huge building that's in front of us right there And now, to update the book. So here we are, a little Hagia Sophia. Definitely making use of that hook blade to get up. And as you guys will see just here, underneath the roof tile, likely in code again. Aesop's Fables by Socrates being found. And that is part three. So now we have the Maiden Tower unlocked. Which takes us to the next point. I've completed this particular tier of the mission. make our way back across as you guys can see the city we do have just here an assassin's den um, we do have if you remember a lot of um, assassin's den missions to complete mm, trying your, not to yawn on camera is extremely hard especially when you're as tired as I am when you work as much as I do but as we were saying, making our way back across the city 
as you can see, charging towards this next location. Obviously, you can see the option of the arrow storm flashing up, and that's purely because of the guards. As we storm our way through, I tell you, no ill will. Maybe, but you got in the way. As we charge our way through the Constantinia countryside, you will notice that we have made our way back down, back down, back down even, to the docks. And as you can see right here, this is where our trip takes us to. And we are now at the Maiden's Tower. A clue left behind by the Paralos has brought Ezio to the Maiden's Tower. Investigate the tower, but be careful. Obtain the Masyaf key without falling into the water. Now, unfortunately, that is easier said than done. But as you guys can see, it is extremely dark. Just to come on a night where it is raining. So here we are. An assassin's mark on a floor tile. Find an access, or find a way to access the tower's lower chamber. We've seen these before. Now we can see where we need to get to. get to it. So explore the underground cavern and as you can see right here as in many of the games we have a hidden series. Another interaction required. This one's slightly different. Maiden Tower's puzzle. So as you can see, we actually need to get back over there, but unfortunately it's more a case of up there. So. <coughs> as we decide to make our way back around. one of those fortunate locations where we cannot charge through and do everything at 100 mile an hour.
And here we have our next interaction. And we have the next train of pulley system. Basically, that takes us into a back jack. <coughs> that is now closed. And attempt number two. Let's try to get through Hagia Sophia. As you can see, not a way to easily make our way through. Finally, at the next interaction point. So, a quick yank on this. Grease the chains, open up some more. Definitely grateful for that hook blade. just making it in time. And again, don't, don't go down more, pushing that water up, allowing it to drain away. To finally reach the bottom of Hagia Sophia. And as you can see, yet again, we have another interaction. So there are definitely quite a few in this still interaction. If you guys are wondering what I'm looking at, a little uh, candle here, but the candle sat here for such a long time that I couldn't be bothered trying to light it, so I stuck incense into it. But we've actually had that burning, just like Ezio does when he's out and about. goes our 100% synchronization. So 
as you can see, it is extremely easy to make a mess up like that. And as you can see, we are where the uh, entrance is. Unfortunately, if I look to it, we're not going to be able to get down there in time. But as you can see, everything is actually um, locked off. And, oh, we actually need to swing into it. Oh, wow. Well, back we go. Come on, it's go, it's up we go. So we lost 100% synchronization, and you saw how easy it was to uh, try. Oh well, there we go again. Well, that second time didn't even get anywhere near it. So as you can see, we are definitely going to make our way back. <coughs> as you can see, Esso has literally automatically swung around and literally dived into the temple itself, into the temple area. our way up we have the final jump and so grateful for that hook 1670 ache and three sticky pouches I will definitely take that 447 sulfur and sulfur is now full Jeez. And now, granted we didn't get the uh, the hundred percent like we have done with the rest of them, but it is extremely difficult when you have that much water and there's so many different areas to try and actually get into. So, as you guys have easily seen, it is extremely easy to. Uh, lose that 100% so as you can see we actually come back out onto the docks and we will be progressing I'm just trying to um, actually get into something right here so give us uno momento por favor <laughs> 